Fonny, Vol Thursday, got a good few runners after a very good days racing at Turfentain. Queen of Verona, very, very good family, if I'm not mistaken, related to a Group 1 filly called Temple Graffin. Yeah, no, that's right. Um, she's well bred. She will need this experience. Um, so run, run will bring her on a lot. Um, but I won't exclude her in the quartet. Count your chances and together again, are together again in race number three. Our counter chances is a second run for the stable. The first one she ran third. Good run, she ran on strongly. Um, straight home is on her. So um, she's got an each way chance. Together again, she needs to improve to, to show us more. Okay, so how does it work with Pierre? Does he phone for the rides or do you just uh, take your chances and hope you get him? <laughs> no, no, they, he phones. His agent phones. Uh, and then striker matches in the fourth. Yeah, she's a uh, first run from a very long layoff. Um, I think the thousand will be too sharp for her now, and she will need a run. But she's working well, looking well, and she's got class. So if she runs to 80% of her potential, she can run the first three. Magic Flower is alone in race number six. Yeah, this horse is so unlucky to get draws and to get him in the right races. I'm running him from a wide draw around the inside track. I don't like to do that, um, but he needs racing. So this is just a run to get him fit, fitter, uh, racing fit. Okay, super. And then Mo Jive is alone in the seventh? Mo Jive is the second run after the rest. His first run was on a, a distance way too short for him. He ran a very good race, ran a good second. Some horses, yeah, they do have a flat run. But um, I think he'll be okay. Super. And then your last runner of the day is um, a filly with, uh, with limitations, but she can deliver some decent performances in treaty. Yeah, Andrew, that all the pens is on the online auction out today. Um, if I don't get my reserve, I'll run her. If I get my reserve, I'll probably sell her. Do you think that she's still got potential to race in Port Elizabeth? Yeah, even here. I mean, uh, races when I didn't need to run a short of a distance, when she ran over 14 or 16, she's always four or five lengths off um, in good fields. So even here, if she's got the right race, she can win the race one or two more. Um, she will like PE a lot. She will, I think she'll do good in PE.